Hi, Heidi Heron here. Today I'm answering a question about how NLP can help a relationship. We all have relationships of some sort, don't we? If it's with ourselves or family, friend, romantic relationships, they are all around us. And the world is better with relationships. A question that I'm answering today is how does NLP help with romantic relationships? Now I inquired a little bit and this person that asked it knows a bit about NLP but didn't really see how NLP could help with relationships. They look at it more as a, a tool to use with others or a business tool, for example, like sales tool, which it can be. But NLP has so much more scope than just that. I would say one area that NLP helps people most in personally is their relationships where we often go awry, where things go wrong in relationships, romantic relationships particularly, but any kind of relationship, is a lack of communication or understanding each other. Sometimes there's a lot of communication, but we're saying different things, we're on the different page. Sometimes we're even playing by a different set of rules. A client that I'm working with at the moment has a, has a, a partner that has had a very different upbringing than him and he gets frustrated with her a lot because she's not following his rules. And I asked, does she know your expectations? And he said, well, I think so. I said, how do you know? Well, I, I give her feedback. I said, yeah, but how does the feedback come across? Well, she doesn't really like it. She starts to shut down on me. I said, okay. So I also know in NLP that communication is the response that you get. So that's not necessarily the response that he's looking for, but it's what he's getting. So he's, she may, and I have to completely mind read on this, but she may be feeling like he's judging her, attacking, nagging, criticizing any of the others, where really what he's trying to do is explain himself to her. Not always easy to do. So NLP can really help in relationships by helping us to respect another person's model of the world, be able to communicate more effectively, ask better questions instead of make assumptions, to change patterns of emotions, behaviors, and thoughts that might not be working for us. Sometimes we even transfer relationships from other people, our parents, past relationships, past partners, onto our current relationship. And we treat that person in a certain way because of somebody else's mistakes or because of what somebody else did before. And that's not really fair, is it? So NLP has a way to, to help us alleviate, relieve the tensions or the animosities or the, the discord or whatever it is that came from previous relationships or previous interactions with people so that we can start on the clean blanks, blank slate. NLP also will help you to understand yourself better. And when you can understand you, then you can be able to communicate more effectively. You can be able to listen more effectively, love yourself even better, and be the best version of you that you can be. So it probably starts with a relationship with yourself, but there are so many different ways that NLP can trickle into a romantic relationship or any kind of relationship that will help you to make it even better.